The cycle of incarceration and re-entry into society carries the potential for profound adverse consequences for prisoners, their families, and communities. Here's how one man has broken that cycle by putting his time in for the Palm Beach County Graphics Department. I went to prison at the age of, age of 17. Um, I was given multiple life sentences. So I um, grew up in a single parent household and my mom, you know, she done everything that she could do for me, but like a hard-headed little boy, I decided to just do things my own way and um, I, paid, I paid for it. He was of the mind that uh, if I can ever get out of here, I need to earn my way out. Don't let the people define you by your past. You can actually make good decisions from this point forward. Always do right. It will gratify some and astonish the rest. So it should be spraying a lot of powder. And he did. And so for all these different things that he did, there, he earned early release credits. And he was doing this practically from day one. When I got to prison, I was able to get my um, high school diploma. And then I started working for Pride. I was working in the print shop and I have been doing printing for over 20 years. I have several certificates uh, in the print industry. A couple years ago, we had an opening for a printer two position. We interviewed eight people. Um, and he was the top candidate. I think that an employer is looking for somebody who they can rely on, who will come to work, do the job, and, and participate in the organization. You, you can do anything you put your mind to. So um, as I began to develop my talents, those guys told me, say, well, learn everything you can learn. Because you never know when you get a chance to get out of this place. Um, you can probably turn that into a career. You know, we have done some bad things in the past, but just take a chance on us and, um, you know, it can, it can, you can reap, you know, big rewards from that. Why wouldn't an employer want to hire a guy who actually earned his way out of prison? I mean, that tells you a lot about, about him personally. When I first started this job, I didn't have a car. So I was getting up at like 4.30 in the morning, getting on the bus just before 6 o'clock, and riding the bus around here for, you know, maybe two or three months. Even uh, my coworkers here at Graphics, they tell me all the time, they say, wow, you spent that much time in prison, you just seem so normal. You know, it's, it's like, you know, everything is, it's like it never happened. So I have this saying that comes from Nelson Mandela. Um, and the saying is, as I walk out of these gates towards my freedom, I need to learn to leave all the bitterness, anger, and hatred behind or I'll still be in prison.